Bob and this is Abigail Sheets and we are at Parkway High School. We are in a small village of Rockford, Ohio, pretty much in the middle of nowhere. The four segments you will be watching are I'm Weak, Slayer Nay, Cooking with Coach, and Chooketh. The first one is I'm Weak where you will hear corny jokes and pickup lines. Can't wait to hear. My name is Josie Waters. I'm a junior here at Parkway High School and you're watching I'm Weak. I'm Weak is a game where you have water in your mouth and you try not to laugh while I tell jokes. And here are our contestants and they will tell you a little about themselves. Hi, my name is Allie Rowan and I am a junior at Parkway and I like to do volleyball and bowling. Hi, my name is Emily Schaefer. I'm a junior at Parkway, and a fun fact about myself is that during my first cross-country race, I passed out. Hi, I'm Dakota, and I'm a junior. Hi, I'm Timothy Green, and I'm a junior in high school, and I play lots of video games. It's very, very bougie, real king. So, we are going to start off with our first question. So, so, yeah. Okay. Did you fall from heaven? Because your face is pretty messed up. <laughs> I'd say Dakota, that was a laugh. Okay. <laughs> Junior, that's a laugh. <laughs> okay. That's a laugh. Good thing I brought my library card, because I'm checking you out. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Hey, girl. Feel my sweater, because it's boyfriend material. We are going to crown the winner, okay? So, we have our contestants. <laughs> and the person who laughed the least amount is Junior. <laughs> okay, no. Sit down. Okay. There he is. I am crowned. Those were some funny jokes. Yeah, they were. <laughs> I really like to pick up lines. Maybe I'll use one this weekend. Our second segment is Slay or Nay. They will be talking about the latest fashion trends and music. I can't wait to hear it. Maybe some of our favorites will be in it. I'm Casey, and right now we're doing a segment of fashion trends. We're going to do two fashion trends. One's bell bottoms and one is leg warmers. And right now I'm with our teacher, Miss Smalley. Hi, I'm Mrs. Smalley. I teach English, world history. I live on a farm and I'm a new mom. Here is the first picture. Tell us how you feel about it. So, bell bottoms are great, but those bell bottoms are a bit too much, a little too wild. So I think I would wear regular bell bottoms if they came back in style, but there's no way on earth I would ever wear those. Makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> the next thing is leg warmers. So those are some pretty funky leg warmers. Um, I don't think they'll come back in style. I would never wear them. I mean, if you've got pants and socks, why do you really need those? Uh, and I especially wouldn't wear them with my high heels. I completely agree. Okay, 
Okay, so now we're gonna do our game. We're just gonna play a few seconds of the song, and you have to guess the next lyrics of the song. Right here now we have. Oh hi, <clears throat> I'm Olivia Osborne. <laughs> Kirsten Deitch, <laughs> Brinley Hauser, Grace Ponsler. Okay. Okay, Liv, get, Liv gets the point. Smooth like butter. Like a criminal. Okay, this is the last song. And the winner is Kirsten. Here's your prize, Kirsten. Thank you. You're welcome. I love it. <laughs> I really like the bell bottoms. Very cute. Going to have to look into them. Maybe they're gonna become a trend soon. I think they would suit your style. Anyways, now we're gonna go to Cooking with Coach. I'm excited to see who's gonna win. Maybe we'll get some. Hi, my name is Cora Shum and I'm on the segment Cooking with Coach. Here we have our first contestant, Woodrow. Hi, I'm Woodrow Tinkum and I'm a sophomore from Parkway High School and I taught Gordon Ramsay how to cook. And now our second contestant, Coach Hughes. Hi, I'm Coach Hughes. I'm an intervention specialist at Parkway and I also uh, coach basketball. And Thanks, Coach. And now on to the baking. Hi, I'm back, and now we're with the judges. Here's our first judge. What do you think? Coach Hughes smells very good. I feel like it's going to be a little too textbook, you know. I'm excited to taste Woodrow's because he put two cups of sugar in his brownies, man. I mean, I'm excited for this competition. Go Woodrow. Hi, I'm Kaylin Regadans, and I'm a freshman this year. <laughs> I think Coach Hughes did a pretty good job at making the brownies. And I'm not sure about Woodrow, on the other hand. <laughs> this is a little iffy. Hi, I'm Matthew Roberts. I'm a freshman at Parkway. Uh, Woodrow, his brownies, they don't, they, at least they make me not hungry anymore. And Coach But dang, these are good. Now, Woodrow's had a nice consistency, a nice texture. Coach Hughes it was very smooth, very, um, I don't know how to say it, but overall, I think my winner is Woodrow, but Coach Hughes was a very close second. All right, so I think that Woodrow's brownies are, they're, they're good, they stayed together well, but I feel like they're a little too dry. And Coach Hughes's, his is good, it's very messy. <laughs> it doesn't stay together, but I think it tastes better, so I vote Coach Hughes. I think I like Woodrow's better because it has like the perfect consistency and it's not too sweet. And I think Coach Hughes, his were a little bit too sweet, so I think I vote for Woodrow. Well, thank you all, all you judges. And now to tell the contestants the results vote for mine and I, I didn't really like the way mine looked when they uh, turned out I would have voted for Woodrow too well, thanks coach you and now to tell our winner what do you think Woodrow you won I'm very surprised <laughs> that's really all I gotta say well thanks Woodrow and thanks for tuning into this episode of cooking with coach I really enjoyed watching cooking with coach I wish I was there to try the brownies I like brownies a lot me too. Okay. Um, now we're going to do Shooketh. We will learn a few things about our staff here at Parkway through trivia. 
Maybe we'll learn a few things. Hi, I'm Abigail, and this is Hallie. This is Shooketh. This is a teacher trivia where you will be guessing what teacher matches the question. The teacher options are Mr. Minnick, Mrs. Miller, Mrs. Houts, Mr. Gudorf. At the end of each round, we will say who got it right and what the answer was. Our players will now introduce themselves, name and grade. Addison Heilman, sophomore. Brittany Seitz, sophomore. Julia Sheets, sophomore. Tyler Greer, sophomore. Round one. Whose biggest fear is that they will lose their teaching job and be forced to be a plus size model again? The answer was Mr. Minnick. Round two. Two truths. My wife gave birth to three children. I love musical therapy. Correct, Mr. Gudorf. Round three. What teacher has traveled to London? The answer was Mrs. Houts. Round four, what teacher mooned a vehicle while riding the school bus? Mrs. Miller was the correct answer. Our winners are Addison Heilman and Julia Sheets. Addie, how did you like the game on a scale from 1 to 10 and why? Um, I gave it a 9. My favorite part was when I heard that Miss Miller stuck her butt out the bus window. And I liked the game. It was fun and it got me out of class. Julia, how did you like the game on a scale from 1 to 10 and tell us why? Um, I enjoyed the game. I would give it like a 9 out of 10. There could have been more questions to make the game go longer, but it got me out of class, so that's all that matters. Wow. I never would have thought that Mrs. Miller would be someone to moon somebody on the school bus. Thank you all for watching the Parkway Reach and Teach episode. We hope you enjoyed watching the funny segments we had and the reaction on people's face. Please share with your friends and family and let us know what you think of the segment.